Hi, it's a wonderful day today. The sun is shining. Over where I am, the sun is shining, but it could be raining in your area or it could be snowing. But whatever it is, it's a wonderful day in the Lord. And today, I'm going to be reading you the story of creation. And this is a storybook Bible by International Children's Bible, illustrated by Victor Hogan. Hallelujah, children of color storybook. It's a wonderful book to read. Hallelujah. So let's talk about the story of creation. In the beginning, the earth was dark and empty. There was nothing to see. No people, no animals, and no trees. Not a living thing existed. Then God said, Let there be light. And there was light. God saw that the light was good. So he divided the light from darkness. God named the light day and the darkness night. Evening passed and morning came. This was the first day that the Lord made. On the second day, God created the sky. That was the second day that the Lord made. On the third day, God said, Let the water under the sky be gathered together so the dry land will appear. And it happened. God named the dry land earth. He named the water that was gathered together seas. He also commanded that the plants trees, fruit, and grain grow. Beautiful greenery fill the earth. God saw that all this was good. That was the third day that the Lord made. On the fourth day, God said, let there be lights in the sky to separate day from night. These lights will be used for signs, seasons, days, and years. God also made two powerful lights, the brighter one called the sun to rule the day, and the other called the moon to rule the night. Then God made the stars and put them and the rest of the lights into the sky to shine on the earth. God saw that all these things were good. That was the fourth day that the Lord made. On the fifth day, God created the living creatures of the sea and birds to fly above the earth. God blessed them and said, Have many young ones and grow in number. Fill the water of the seas and let the birds grow in number on the earth. That was the fifth day that the Lord made. On the sixth day, God created all kinds of tame and wild animals. This was the day he also created the people to be like himself. They would rule the fish, birds, and other living creatures. God looked at everything he had made, and it was very good. This was the sixth day that the Lord made. By the seventh day, God finished the work he had been doing. So on the seventh day, he rested from all his work. God blessed the seventh day and made it a holy day. God was very pleased with all he had done. This comes from Genesis 1 and 1 through Genesis 2 and 3. Good night.